What's up guys, welcome to the episode of Baby Bureau. Bureau. We are currently walking to Phantom Carriage Brewery in Carson. It's St. Patrick's Day, of course. It's a beautiful day outside. And we're gonna get right into it. Right, Lars? Get right into it. That's right, stick around. to it. Oh yeah. It was last time you went to a beer festival and I had a blast. Great taste of the Midwest. Two years back had a nice solid glass, but the next year they had more of a plastic. Glass beast right out of the can. Ooh. In collaboration with the record label Nuclear Blast, uh, we have the Blast Beast India Pale Lager. This thing is sweet and pleasant. Um, you're getting great cascading hop notes, uh, very floral forward. It's a little bit easier to drink than uh, India Pale Ale because it's an uh, India Pale Lager actually, so it's just very drink drinkable. Well, this is the Voice of Terror by Phantom Carriage. It is a 8.8% um, barrel aged sour, and it's got some vanilla notes apparently into it. For a sour that has vanilla, this is done right. I've never had a vanilla, a sour or a goss that has like, or ghost, sorry, that has vanilla in it. It's tilling the nose already, so. Very slight. The vanilla taste is very, very slight. The actual sour um, comes in. Not very acidic. Then again, I don't like my sours very acidic, so. Um, Compared to everything else I've had, Dude, this vanilla is, it, it pretty much makes it unique in a way that I've never had a, a sour or a gloss like this before. Again, 8%, doesn't taste like it. Probably will feel it later, but I like it. This, this is, this is a, if, you, if you have any sour, try this one for sure. I'm here today, coming to visit for just a little tiny bit. Scott, and he has yeah, to leave Scott. the go to a marathon because of the crazy animal he is. So, now we're going to the Enigma. Take two. Take two. Now we're on to the Enigma machine. I don't remember how much ABV is in this, but it's doing this all IPA, so you know it's a higher percentage beer. Obviously. <laughs> uh, probably because the wind is blowing and really fucking up all of my, you know, olfactory senses, Just but it. this, it's time to drink it, right? Exactly. <laughs> It's got a little spice to it. It reminds me a lot of State Brewing's IPA, uh, a New England solid IPA. It's a little juicier, actually. I'm like, uh, don't know how I feel about this just yet. Interesting finish. That's what I can say about this. Um, for a New England solid IPA, mm, it's hit or miss with me. I can't tell just yet. Are I'll get back with you. Are you enjoying this IPA right here? I, I mean, I am, but I, I don't know how I feel about it. I guess because I had the porter, that's why I wouldn't get to that just right now. I want to like destroy this right now. I want to steal his. I want to steal Sean's order right now. Yeah, let's <laughs> but, go uh, for it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but Sean, can you imagine like if you had like straight up like a tiki like party here, and like you had all sorts of death metal stuff here, and fucking like you just have like yeah, you just have like a whole bunch of like lays and like a white 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 black yeah black metal lighter, like that, makeup and shit. Ben. Ben. Ben Russell. Ben Russell. Sick artwork. Definitely check him out, please. David Bowie. David Bowie. Well, David Bowie, sorry. Bowie. Ziggy <laughs> Stardust. Yeah. Dude. I saw more too. Look this at that. Amazing. House From of a Thousand, thousand Corpses. Thousand corpses dude. This guy's a man. Why is it 
Well, guys, that wraps up St. Patrick's Day 2018 at Phantom Cares Brewery in Carson, California. Also, their their anniversary. So kudos to that. I had a blast. Um, of course, pun intended for nuclear blast. And as always, please be sure to share this with your friends, family, beer drinkers, potential beer drinkers, and anyone that may even be remotely interested in my content, because I'll forever love you for it. That being said, cheers. And always drink better beer.